21st tonight, Enrique Padilla faced a judge today, eight days after allegedly shooting and killing a man over movie seats. Padilla was also hurt in that theater shooting last weekend. Now he's charged with first degree murder and prosecutors argued today he's too dangerous to be released before trial. Feliz Romero sat in on his pretrial detention hearing today. Feliz, the state focused a lot of their time on what investigators outlined in that criminal complaint. Yeah, Julie, the state did not waste any time calling Enrique Padilla a danger to society, saying he was callous and had no regard for human life that night. They also said there were simply no conditions to keep the public safe pending trial. While Padilla has no criminal history other than this shooting, the state went through the criminal complaint saying when you boil it down, he fired eight shots into a crowded theater following an argument over movie seats. Two of those shots hit and killed 52-year-old Michael Tenorio. The state said it was pure luck that no one else was hit or killed. Meanwhile, the defense took a different approach, arguing self-defense. They say Mr. Tenorio got up and pushed Padilla against a wall before a weapon was produced. There were witnesses talking about the laser uh, from the firearms just going throughout the um, theater. Um, that type of behavior does create uh, a very dangerous situation, so I, the state has met that burden. Ultimately, the judge disagreed with Padilla's self-defense claim, saying he can't create the situation by starting a fight and throwing popcorn at the Norio and his wife and then claim self-defense. The judge granted the pretrial detention motion. Padilla will remain behind bars until his trial. All right, Felice, thanks so much for the update.